And surely we will die without memory, coming to cold in the shadow of space. And if it isn't too late for the star to love you, spraying the sky with whispers attuned to galaxies hungry for flame. And if the tongue of night sings of albino winos till the morning light shafts the doorway, then surely we will die tonight, faceless at the white gate, sharing the smoke with ancient shapes in future garb. And you stand somewhere there on the other side, feeding on the pain of dreamlessness, where from the misty morning of white shadows and the unresisting need to destroy. Samael, Samael, I beg it may be forgiven that they may be driven out of the black into the white. Only let the dazzle remain for gamblers to surprise. The strategic diamond, the throne of compressed bone in the unsure dark where only light can forgive and your mind is signed. Embers of echoes in the vastness disguise the yearning to burn blind eyes in arrogant displays of feeling. Running wild, these beasts will feast on the newborn kind, for surely we will die tonight unless we learn to ignore what the others live for on the other side of morning. And the skin of nothing left by the same summer masks the faceless wanderer. Oh, let it happen. This weird to discover the shape of beauty in everything extreme. For surely we will die tonight, whether we will or whether we dream. Oh, Samael, forgive the dreamer, forgive the dream. The song of nothing is your lullaby. This is my history. New York City, 1992. There are blind spots everywhere. Someone stands on a stage begging for help. What is it eating my vitals and the vitals of my friends? Selling death is the business of the capitalist state. No longer loves cannot rise above the subway. Looking through the bicycle wheel, one remembers a pyramid. The prophets push up the sewer covers and enter the streets by night. We are crowded into small rooms which cannot contain us. A young mother dreams of wrecking crews, yet the children find the sun, the leaf, the bird. Make the tongue rare to fill the space with meaning. In the text, we presuppose keys, hope to find wetness. Once people slept in gardens, now not even photography can get you out of prison. Must I read the Science Times to know that the monarch's migration is a fragile journey? With a small amount of human negligence, everything could disappear. My last thought as I finally fell into a fitful sleep. My first thought as I picked up the telephone to get the bad news. Glamour will not save our wintering grounds. Better to stay a caterpillar and munch leaves than to risk all for the dazzling moment of flight and the priceless illusion of freedom, hardly. A butterfly's brain is only the size of a pinhead, yet it knows how to get to Mexico, hitching rides on winds and spiraling columns of warm air. But the end of monarchs as we know them is here. I am learning to stay quietly in this apartment with my mother, waiting for Lakshmi. We are dead souls on a cyclical journey. Future tourists will come to marvel at our poems, festooning the gables of a broken civilization. Motels will be named after us, and children will parade in monarch costumes when the season of our return is remembered. Goodbye, elephant. Goodbye, whale. Hello, AIDS virus. Smaller is perhaps stronger after all. My dreams were bigger than any whale, and sometimes I dove even deeper. <laughs>